news now. Starting next year, UNLV is planning to plant more than 2,000 trees across the valley. 8 News Now weather reporter Mary Jane Villiesa shares that it's in order to fight extreme heat. Las Vegas is one of the fastest warming cities in the country. It's increased in temperature by 8 degrees Fahrenheit since 1970. And because of that, we have one of the worst urban heat island effects in the country. Heat islands are urbanized areas emitting higher temperatures due to black asphalt and other structures. You may notice it walking on the strip or downtown, even in your neighborhood. UNLV student Nathaniel Church is learning about this study. For my area, my neighborhood, we have like a 24% tree coverage, so we're doing pretty good. The orange flags are the mid-range, 11 to 20 percent. Allison Sloat, an associate professor at UNLV's College of Sciences, wants to combat extreme heat thanks to a five million dollar grant allowing UNLV to plant trees. We've been working with the Nature Conservancy and other groups to try to figure out how many trees are needed to help impact or help mitigate the urban heat island effect in Las Vegas. So we will grow and plant these trees and educate certified arborists in training who will help take care of those trees in the decades to come. Arborists and other volunteers will plant trees surrounding UNLV, the east side of Las Vegas, historic west side, and parts of north Las Vegas. UNLV student Claire Martinson is from Illinois. She feels the weather difference compared to the Midwest. If they decrease the amount of cement and increase the in amount of organic materials like grass or trees, it could have a positive impact. Future trees will be native and drought tolerant, as the grant also allows community partners to plant in private residences. Mary Jane Valleza, 8 News Now. So the project gets underway in the very first month of the next year. It's expected to last five years as UNLV and community partners also work to educate schools about the importance of planting trees.